Hi everyone, welcome to Low Carb Revelation. I am Paula and I live a keto, low carb lifestyle and I have experienced some amazing health benefits because of it. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to make a very simple, quick, easy breakfast. If you've watched my videos in the past, you will know that I love quick, easy meals. And today I'm gonna to show you how I make baked French eggs. And these are delicious. So stay tuned. Okay, to start off, I am using melted butter to grease the muffin tins with. You can use cooking spray with this as well, but the butter gives the eggs a buttery taste. So I'm just gonna do six eggs today. I'm just gonna grease six of these little cups. Make sure there's plenty of butter. I'm going to just add my eggs. These are pasture-raised eggs from Aldi. These have a really vibrant yolk. And so I like using these for this. And I'm just going to crack the egg into the tin. Very simple. I don't know why I'm always so nervous when I'm cracking eggs on camera. <laughs> Otherwise, I just whip them in there. Get those vibrant orange yolks. Looks so delicious. Okay, the thing I'm gonna be adding is heavy whipping cream. I'm gonna be adding about a teaspoon, teaspoon and a half to each egg cup. I do. Two. Just makes them really creamy. Now you're not gonna stir this. You're not gonna scramble this. You're gonna leave it just like this. Let's do each one. Okay. Now you're gonna add your cheese on top. I'm gonna be using smoked Gouda. I love Gouda with eggs. It tastes so delicious to me. So I'm gonna be using that, but you could use Parmesan, you could use pepper jack, you could use any kind of cheese that you want. Okay, make sure that your cheese is all inside the cup so it's not sticking to the outside when it bakes. And then the last thing that you're gonna add is a little bit of salt and pepper, and you know that I am using my Redmond's salt. It's delicious, it's healthy, it has lots of minerals, it's unrefined. I have a discount link down below in the description. A little bit of pepper, just a little bit of pepper for me. Okay, I have my oven preheated to 375 degrees and I'm gonna pop these in the oven and I'm gonna let them cook. If you like them soft, like runny in the middle, you're gonna do it for about six to seven minutes. Every oven is different, so it may vary for you. Semi-soft would be eight to nine minutes. I prefer my yolk to be hard, so I am gonna be doing 10 to 11 minutes on these, and I will show you what they look like when they come out. These are ready. These right here were baked for 10 minutes in my oven, and as you can see, the yolk is not runny. I know that a lot of people like a runny yolk. I just don't like a runny yolk. So I have mine, I would say it's like a semi-hard. These are packed with nutrition and great flavor. I would say when you pull these out of the oven to let them sit for a minute or two so they can cool, then take a knife and run it around the edges and then use a little spatula to gently lift them out and you have a perfect little egg cup. I'm gonna go ahead and try these for you today. These are so delicious and I love smoked Gouda as my cheese choice. It's so good. If you're not sure what type of cheese that you wanna use, try the smoked Gouda. It is so good. Also, I can taste the butter around the edges that I grease the pan with. And so it is a delicious combination of flavors. And so I'm gonna go and I will see you in my next video. Have a great day, God bless.